Welcome back to The Older Creator. I'm Bruce. We're still talking cap cut editing. Today it's all about templates. Let's go. Okay, folks, so we're talking cap cut editing, and today it's all about templates. So, what's a template? I found this wonderful description of what templates are and make it pretty succinct. This is from a, a website called Synthesia, and they do AI video content creation for newbies. But that's not the point. What's a template? And this is how they describe it. A video template is a pre-designed set of graphical elements, animations, and text that can be used to create a professional-looking video. Video templates often come with a range of built-in features such as music, transitions, and effects. Okay, so what's that going to do for us? Well, with these little video clips that they create, with all these effects and transitions and cool stuff, you can insert your own content into that content and have all of those effects, transitions, etc. reflect your content. So, what does that mean? Let's take a look. So, I've pulled up uh, CapCut. I've opened it up. Opened up a new uh, creation here. And we're going to go up to the top and we're going to hit Templates. And over to the side... Templates will open up and give you all kinds of different categories to select from. Now, these are not all of the templates that are built into CapCut. There are more than what you would be able to access just hitting these different uh, category buttons. But if you have something that you're trying to do, these categories, as always, will help you to cull through all the various options that you have in templates and narrow your focus down. So what I'm going to do today is create a new intro for the older creator. And let's see, we're going to click on intros and it's going to bring up all these different options. Now, what I want to show you is if I hover over it, it's going to be a mini uh, example of exactly what that's going to be. If we want to see it bigger, click on it, and it's going to play in our viewer, and it's going to tell us exactly what elements this is doing. So, as we go along, I'm going to just show you a few of them. Uh, all of that would be, you'd be able to do... And you're going to be able to put who the guests are, who's that person on the microphone, the text that's on it. You'll be able to change all of that and make it yours. They're showing you an example of how it was used to get your motor running and start to consider what you might want to do. That would be for a news channel, and you could fill in the blanks with your own materials. Now, I've picked one out that I kind of liked, and we're going to go scroll down to that now, see if we can find it. There it is. Okay. wonder why it's not... Okay. So, I kind of liked this. It had the right vibe for me. Okay. It kind of... You think so? Let me know in the comments below. But anyway, so what it's showing us is how that template would work for CapCut to do their... Uh, do a nice intro for them. Well, we want to do an intro for the older creator. So, the first thing we're going to do is take the template and put it in the timeline. There it is. Okay, now, if we click on it, that little box pops up. This is going to be where we're going to be able to put in our personal stuff to make it ours. So, when we click on that, it's going to pull up my selection of the place that I go, it's Finder on my uh, Apple, but where all of my uh, clips and photos and all of that stuff are, live. And I'm going to take my uh, logo and import it into this template. And if we go back to the beginning and play it now, what do we have? 
the older creator. There you go. You want to highlight that. Now, we've got the menu up here that we frequently have when we highlight a clip. And there are all kinds of different things we can do to it. First thing we want to do is increase the scale because I can't even see that thing. So now, when we play it, what's it look like? That's a little better. Now, I think it's probably a little too big. What do you think? It goes out of the frame. So I want to bring it down just a little bit so that the whole box stays visible. And I think that might do it. So let's try that. That's pretty good. I like it. Now, uh, th that's how templates work. It has an overall structure, and you're going to add your elements to it to make it your own. So on this one, what do you think of that? Should I use it? I kind of like it. Um, it's quick, it's fast, it's mellow. Well, I'm fairly mellow. So. I think I might keep that and actually use it on my channel. But the point is, you could do anything you want with any of these. Um, you'll see some of them are going to be high energy and crazy. Some of them are going to be whimsical. Here's a Christmas festival. Whoa. <laughs> Anyway, you get the idea. So, there's all kinds of different templates. And they uh, I'll be honest with you, a lot of these are going to be, you, you won't like them. Most of them you're not going to like because they're just not your vibe, your, your, uh, your personality. Um, some of these are, uh, they're, they're just recreating memes and you can put your names on it and who's who in this this element who they, they seem to be beating up the little red man who uh who do you like beating up and you got these two people on the side and you name them this is not interesting to me personally but if it is to you great use them there's a lot of stuff that could be a lot of fun and you you know toss them back and forth between your friends and so forth but there are some of them that are really, they're tools. And in the search box, uh, let's say I wanted to uh, pretend to be a news item. Type in news. Um, news intro. Let's see what that brings up. We're asking people to be on the lookout for a... We're asking people to be on the lookout for a man who robbed a store. Okay. Now, in the case of this, <laughs> it's going to be a joke. That template would come up and you'd be the person in the window on the breaking news window. Okay, it's, it's fine. Uh, these these don't really do a this lot for me. Charged with hitting and killing an IU student back in 2022 accepted a plea deal, including reckless homicide. Invest so all of these are going to have elements that you can replace with your elements and make them yours. It, it, it's a quick way to make a quick video. Uh, one thing I wanted to talk to you, though, about templates. These are specific templates that have all kinds of elements. They might have sound, transitions, effects, text, all kinds of stuff jumbled together and making this thing happen that you kind of insert yourself into, okay? But essentially, when we have been looking at stickers and effects and transitions and even filters, in a way, those are templates too, specific types of templates. So what you're doing is you're uh, uh, all, like a, a, an effect that happens to a particular clip. You could create that with using the different elements that you have available 
inside of your video editing software. You could create that, uh, that element. That's what you're doing with, that's what templates are doing. They're taking elements that you have available to you and moving and mixing them together and creating this box that you can insert yourself into and become part of that scene. A lot of this stuff is stuff that you can do yourself and the, the templates, you're going to spend a ton of time culling through templates to find something that's going to make sense and work for you. Um, now, once you do, some of these templates are quite sophisticated and there are a lot of elements going on. It would take you a long time to create that scene. That's the point of templates. Templates are a time saver. If you see something you like that's doing something that you, that you would really like to do and, and would probably do anyway if you had the time, well, great. Use it, insert your stuff into it, and you'll have a great clip. But don't let it become the entire structure of your creativity in your videos. You've got ideas, too. You don't have to just use somebody else's. So get creative in here. Um, templates can be fine. They can be useful. I think this particular one that we've created here for my uh, opening, it's quite appealing. I like it. So I think I may actually wind up using this. I'm going to export it and keep it. So if that was helpful, give me a like. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. We're growing. We're already in the 80s. I'm excited. Uh, last week we were in the 60s. They're up to 80s. Keep on trucking, guys. Keep on sending it out. Um, if you have anything that you want me to cover, anything that you're interested in regarding video production, editing, for us older people, leave it in the comments. Let me know. Can't respond to you if I don't hear from you. So give me some information. Help me out. Help me help you. Help me help you. Help me help you. Right? Okay. Till next time. I'll see you.